In today's video, we're talking about the nasal septum. Let's use this sagittal dissection of one of the cadaver's heads to talk about the nasal septum and a septoplasty, which is the corrective procedure to fix a deviated septum. So the nasal septum's job is to separate the nasal cavity into left and right passageways. And you can see that as I kind of poke my probe and it kind of shows up in the nasopharynx just above the uvula or your soft palate. So this septum is made of different tissues. We have cartilage, this is hyaline cartilage, and we have bone, we have the ethmoid bone, and we have the vomer bone. Now, it's also gonna be connected to the nasal bones, and you can see that up here, and that's important because typically, if someone gets a deviated septum, it occurs from trauma. Now, it can also happen naturally. This septum can deviate to the right, Typically though, it's not severe enough to cause a deviated septum, but it can happen. But let's go ahead and say you experience some kind of trauma to the nasal bones, right? Well, since it's connected, you could then see how this could possibly skew to the left or right. So in a septoplasty, they will come in and remove a portion of this cartilage. Now there are two membranes on the either side that will then come together, so it's not as though you have a hole in your nasal cavity, but that will then free up the passageway for you to breathe freely again. It's a very simple procedure, um, but you can still see that there is a lot going on with it.